Hello and welcome back to some Return to Monkey Island. My goal for today is to get to the docks. Um, there were some things that I noticed though while I was playing, or not while I was playing, while I was editing. Um, the last episode, there were a few things I missed back this way that I'm very interested in. One is the graffiti. Apparently I can look at their graffiti. Looks sort of like an eye. I think it's a chandelier. A lot of, um... Little pieces. Looks like a volcano island with horns that swallowed a basketball. There's some back here. And I want to check out the alleyway as well. And then I'm going to finish exploring the island. The island. This place has kind of gone downhill. What kind of person would just paint on a wall like that? This one. It doesn't look finished. Yeah. Okay, that's all I wanted to do. And then to check out the alley, which played a major role in Monkey Island 2. So I'm curious what they have back here. Yeah, it was too, with the voodoo doll. And then you come up here, you assemble the voodoo doll. It seems to be stuck closed. Ooh. Oh well. That is what it is. I was, ex I was expecting more, I suppose. Alright, back to exploring the island, and then... Main goal, get to the docks. I was thinking if I wanted to just go straight for the docks and then like, cause I assume that that'll give me like an objective. And then once I get that objective, then it'll make more sense to explore all these places, but no. Warning, the Ooh, dark forest ahead thing. is deadly and twisty. Maps are highly recommended. Yep, into the forest from sure to get lost. Well, flowers? Purple flowers. These must be teasel. Or alliums. Or clematis. Possibly. Can I pick any flowers in the forest? No. Yes. A classic specimen of Alata needleus. A carnivorous vascular dicot known for its tasteful coloration, slight wiggle, and loads of tiny sharp teeth. I do love a plant with a sharp wiggle. Hopelessly lost without a map. Yep. Okay, so I can't even try to get lost. That's that's fair. And okay, then the shipyard. Maybe that's it. I'm, I do need to pick up a toothbrush, and if I pick wow. it up, then it's I would. Worse um, than I imagined. Oh, it just says tans. It says tans previously owned vessels. So sad. Stands used to be the best place to buy used ships. Only place. The assets of this establishment have been seized to settle a class action lawsuit. Have a nice day. Do they have his toothbrush? The window's all boarded up, and it's very dark in there. Is that an old toothbrush? Yay, okay. How do I get in? I need to get in. I have a quest. Is it on my to-do list? No. <laughs> I have the quest. Strange. It's a dried up old sea sponge. Okay, take a sponge and the bucket. Stan used this to clean his ships. It's all rusted out now. Stan used this oh. to clean his ships. I was hoping that when it's it said rust it bucket, now. it would. It looks like the only available ship on the island right now is LeChuck's. Fair enough. A tab just to get some help with I what's when available. These torches lit up Stan's previously owned vessels like a carnival. Yeah. Anything else in the area? It looks like the only available ship on the island right now is LeChuck's. Is there no way in? Oh, maybe I actually... I forgot to check the rest of my inventory last time. I'm not going to use my hint book. Um, do I have anything more in my trivia book? And then eight, six, six, five, three, two, no. And then what else do I have? A uh, state-of-the-art pen. The pen is mightier than the sword. This has gotten me out of a lot of scrapes over the years. Horse armor. It's soft and extra fuzzy. Stuffed animal. It's good for relieving stress. Sponge. I've got a few coins for incidentals. Okay. So really the only things I missed were um, the fact that I have money. And I have a pen with me that I have brought. Which should come handy, I hope. The assets of this establishment have... Alright. Um, back to the path. I will go to the docks so I don't think there's anything else on this map. Oop, oh, oh, yeah, no, that's just the forest. All right. Easy goals. I think I was worried because it was so conversational. Like the, gov the, the governor's mansion and the jail cell both like started a lot of conversation. <laughs> so I was worried that 
there will be more conversation. But I want to get to some puzzle solving and pointing and clicking, gosh darn it. Expedition to fabled Monkey Island. Crew positions available. Serve under LeChuck, the most fearsome pirate on the eight seas. Equal opportunity employer. Inquire here. I'm in. I'm so in. Looking for a job? Step this way. The clipboard in your hand says you're the quartermaster. The crew says I'm the quartermaster. Clipboard doesn't get a vote. You look like a guy without many options. You want a job? I'm sure to swabby. LeChuck's an equal opportunity employer. Even humans are mostly oh, yeah. tolerated. The zombie ghost pirate ship. Honestly, I'm just tempted to take the job. Don't think I'm gonna... I'm definitely not gonna be getting my own expedition together. I'm definitely not getting anything more senior. Let's see what she says. Senior? Well, I need a second mate, a bosun, a ship surgeon, and a gunner. Do you um, think you're qualified for any of those? Great question. I could be second mate. Do you honestly have any idea what a second mate does? Goes to store openings and funerals and waits for the first mate to be incapacitated? I thought so. A bosun. A bosun. Exactly what qualifications have you got for that? I can hold my breath for ten minutes. You sure can. Okay, maybe eight. Don't waste my time, okay? How about ship surgeon? I assume you have some kind of medical degree. Is that a definite requirement? Sorry. I could be the gunner. Oh, I'd be great at that. Boom, boom. You look a little scrawny. What do you bench? A bench? lot. No problem. I sat on one for 12 hours once. I can take it. I have a lot to do today. Maybe Swabby's not so bad after all. The only requirement is that you bring your own mop. If you've got a mop, job a is mop. A... Hey. Oh, hey, she said minute. map. What's your name, sailor? Uh, Andrew LeChuck, no relation. I think an Andrew LeChuck, no relation. Yeah, that's the right answer. Andrew LeChuck, no relation. What a coincidence. It's wild, isn't it? LeChuck gave me a blacklist and you're on it. I what? Oh. You are the blacklist. I'm sorry. Can't hire you. You're obviously Guybrush Threepwood. Assumptions. Well, that's a slight hitch. I'm confused. Didn't you say you were going to get your own ship? Yes, but then suddenly I thought, why bother? I wanted a ship and a crew. Here was a ship and a crew. Right for the taking. All I had to do was get on board, wait for the right moment, and strike. Strike? Mutiny the crew, seize the ship. Be a pirate. Except they wouldn't hire you because they knew who you were. Yeah, that was a problem. Also, I needed a mop. I keep reading that as map. So I need a mop and I need a grog. I hope this isn't one of those party cruises. No parking of demonic, ghostly, or undead vessels or scooters. Tuesdays, three to four. Hmm. Looks like this is going to be a long journey. So I need a disguise and I need a mop. And it's not impossible, also it says the ship. How clever. It's perfect. So now I have Why was Wally goals. in such a hurry? He wouldn't sell us out to Madison, would he? I believe he oh, from the would to relieve the pressure upon him in a different way. Yeah, Wally's sign said that he was at the luncheon and the voodoo lady when she left was like, oh, I need to go to a luncheon. So, seems like they're back from their luncheon. Ipso facto, Wally might be uh, at a store and ready to sell me a map of the forest. Hey, Wally. Well, 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 look what the surf washed ashore. It's Guybrush Threepwood. Nice Ooh, to he has a little magnifying. Oh no, I'm gonna Whatever have to steal his. Is. I spent years yeah. in therapy getting over being burned, blinded, blown up, abandoned, and marooned because of you. <laughs> yeah, good times, huh? You're lucky I'm past all that and am running the best map shop within the Caribbean and beyond. For a map, you want to have a map to the secret of Monkey Island, map through the forest. You sure, have a lot of maps. We have a lot of maps in here. We've got so many, you need a map to find them all. Oh, Wally. 
<laughs> a little cartographer humor. Yeah, I'd forgotten how funny it was. <sighs> All right, let's go. Uh, I'm looking for a map through the forest. What are you trying to find in the forest? I don't know. Nothing in particular. Then having a map won't really be any different than wandering around lost, will it? Yeah, but I mean, well, never mind. All right, maybe well, I'm looking for a mop. This is maps and more, not mops and more. Well, I was hoping the and more might include mops. Well, it doesn't. Try asking the cook over at the bar where he got his. Thank you for the lead. You wouldn't happen to have a map to the Secret of Monkey Island. Funny you should ask. I recently made one on commission, but then they destroyed all my source material. Uh, it is the check. only one in existence. Best of luck to you. Looks like the shop across the way is in trouble. The high stakes, ego driven world of pirating is changing, and dark magic is taking over. Voodoo magic is fun and all, but it's not what the new generation wants. Me? I'm on the bleeding edge and making a bundle. I'm about to franchise. The town seems to be pretty run down. Since the kids Captain want maps. Madison made melee her base of operations, people have been complaining. They say she brings a bad element to town, but that bad element spends a lot of money on maps. So, what am I supposed to do? Do what's right? I am. I'm doing what's right for Wally. It's great to see you landed on your feet after all these years. I'm so sorry. Business has been booming with all these new dark magic pirates. Captain Madison has me on a lucrative retainer. She pays extra for a bunch of wacky symbols I just make up. I'll let you get back to cartographing. That's not a real word. It is now. Okay, so um, pirates are goth now, which is great. They're like glasses, only way less convenient. Ooh, look behind you, a three-headed monkey. Oh, please take one. I use them to promote my business. See, it says maps and more on the edge. Uh, thanks. I felt really bad about that, so I'm really glad that that's for I appreciate free. that Wally hasn't traded it in for a new model just because it's been around the block once or twice. I feel very strongly about that for some reason. Wally, can I have one of these maps? Absolutely. If you pay for it. Never mind. I mean, I have money, but I don't need hey, maps. <laughs> it's the pirate life for me. I don't know why I went back yeah. to talk to Wally again. I didn't know you made globes, too. I don't. This is for reference. It's got all the latest continents. So fancy. Ooh, those look fancy. The finest tools to make the finest maps. This must be Trouser Island. Actually, Mr. Threepwood, it's... Yep, Trouser Island. I had a map like this once, but I sailed left. That looks like a treacherous voyage. It says, rating, cursed black diamond. Very spiky. The first rule of piracy is, never buy a used treasure map. That's a good point. It's maps wrapped in maps. I didn't know you could do that. Hey, Wally, what's with the window ladder? I use it to keep an eye on the neighbors. Well, it's good to have a hobby. Good old mazes. Can't get enough mazes. Ooh, this one looks nice. How much is it? Oh, that one? Too much. It looks vaguely familiar, but I don't know. Oh, well, we're just gonna leave. <laughs> We could sit there and comment on maps for a while, but we don't need to do that. So what was I gonna do? I was gonna use the monocle to read the serial number. Ooh, we got a meanwhile. I'm Lechuk shit. Lechuk, sir. Just thought I'd pop in and let you know. Preparations to set sail are almost done. You have all the supplies for the spell to get to Monkey Island? Check. Squid ink, chickens, brimstone, cinnamon, monkey blood, mint, and an annoying skull. Well done! Mark yourself down a lot for of one less lashing this voyage. Uh -oh. <clears throat> uh, funny story. Guybrush Threepwood tried to sign on to the crew. Threepwood? He must be looking for the secret too. Mm, that guy steals all my best ideas. He's so pirate. Wait, 
it. Let him live. I want him to see me sail off for Monkey Island knowing the secret is lost to him forever. Sure. I want to bring this up one more time. Is searching for this mythical secret of Monkey Island a good idea? Shouldn't we be out terrorizing the high seas, instilling fear, creating mayhem, being more on brand for Lichuk? I've had enough of you questioning my orders. Finish loading the ship, and whatever you do, don't let Threepwood on board. Very well. Right. I forgot that Monkey Island does like the random cutscenes. <laughs> yeah, whitey bones. Hey, Guybrush. Hey, kid. All right, let's use. Uh, they say monocle. the only real prison yeah, is yeah, the yeah. one in your head. But take it from me, I can read the serial number. I'll write it down so I don't forget. Smart. And on to the locksmith. She's gonna want money. I don't have money. Or I have some money. Hi it's there. probably not Hi. enough money. Oh. Hello again. Let's click. Uh it's really clean in here. Do you have a mop? I need to get the mop from the kitchen. I simply don't allow filth to accumulate in the first place. Try somewhere a little less sanitary. Like the bar by the docks. Everyone's really nice and giving me hints. Tell me again about how to have keys made. Maybe I I should be using the, me the serial okay. number from yeah, the yeah, yeah. It's pretty I think I'll try not to touch any. So I should have it written down here. Yes. Can you make me a key from this serial number? Sure. Good choice on the lock. These are really sturdy. It's the same kind they use over at the jail. Ooh, wow. What a coincidence. I had no idea. That worked out well. Goodbye, friend. Hey, guy brush. Hey, kid. Howdy doody. What I'll appreciate it first. Stick to the this is awesome. Now I can open one of the jail cells. I'm glad that I took the time to appreciate it. Otis, the authorities have reconsidered your case and decided that you should Jesus. go free. I'm very grateful to the authorities and will not mention their name should any awkward questions be asked. Good luck, Stan. I hope you get acquitted. Oh, it's in the bag, friend, but thanks. I uh, also. I'll stay on this side of the bars, just in case. Smart. I'm gonna Jail have to stand like again. A bad breakfast, small, greasy, and hard to swallow. Not as long as you're having fun. Stan. Hello there, son. Sure, you don't want me to break you out. I've been to the shipyard. Your office is all boarded I've up. I've been to the shipyard. Your office is all boarded up, with your toothbrush sealed inside, presumably. Well, don't worry yourself about it, then, son. I found a dead centipede in the corner that should do until they let me out. I found a dead centipede in my house like a week ago, and it's the first one that I've seen since I've moved here, and I'm like, when is that really? a thing? Yep. I'm like, did my cats kill it? It was just in like the middle of the floor. I Darn. sincerely worried. You know what, Stan, you're good. Okay, so I need to go to the bar and get a mop. That is my next order of operations. I don't know what I got for releasing Otis, but I'm sure that that will become more apparent as we go. I'm not used to filming things like after five, and so my lighting and my hair get weird. Oh well. <gasps> there we go. Oh I was God. like, why is he not there? After all these years, you're still here. I was declared a historical landmark. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the place does seem different from what I remember. It's this new, younger generation of pirate leaders. Oh, they're highfalutin dark magic. Look at us. We're so much better than you because we don't drink grog before getting married. <laughs> These kids today are all about sacking and pillaging. They've got no heart. I'm gonna find the secret of Monkey Island. Wanna come? I heard the secret is just some marketing gimmick Stan thought up. That only the gullible and naive would go looking for it. That's me. Tell me about Tell Loom. Me about Loom. <laughs> I'm so sick of pirates asking me about Loom. Oh, it says don't ask me about Loom. Then why don't you take off the ask me about Loom button? My grog riddled body has fused with it. <laughs> I'm more button than man at this point. Oh, come on. Tell me about Loom. For old time's sake. Beat it. Say it. No! 
Say it. Fine. You mean the latest masterpiece of fantasy storytelling from Lucasfilm's Brian Moriarty? Why, it's an extraordinary adventure with an interface of magic. Stunning, high-resolution 3D landscapes, sophisticated score and musical effects. Not to mention the detailed animation and special effects, elegant point-and-click control of characters, objects, and magic spells. Beat the rush. Go out in by loom today. Yes. Now get lost. Yay, he said the thing, <laughs> and I got an achievement. Nice talking to you. Yeah, yeah. Cool beans. I have now heard about loom, and my life is complete. Nice and hot. I wonder how long I could stand here before bursting into flames. Too long as I look around and double check that there's nothing else. Okay, into the kitchen we go. Guy brush three foot as I live and breathe. How have you been? A statue of a bird out there. Um, Peachy. Peachy, how's Elaine? She was always my favorite governor. Also, she covered your tab when you stopped coming in. She's good. No piece has been missing. Still on public skir surface <laughs> fighting scurvy now. It's a of anniversary, probably in a Monkey Island game I didn't play. That one's depressing. We're part more often than I like. She's here on the island. I'll just say. Still in public service. Fighting scurvy now. My place is clean. Our health certificates are up to date. No, no, it's not like that. She's got a foundation. They're trying to promote limes as a preventative. Oh, well, tell her I say hello. Start to mop. Do you know where I can buy a mop? Buy? <laughs> You don't want to buy a mop. I think I do. The mop is the formal tool of a cook. Not as clumsy or random as a dish rag. An elegant tool for a more civilized cleaning. You cannot hope to succeed with the mop of another. I can't? You must construct your own. A single perfect instrument that you will keep and use for a lifetime. Well, let's hope it doesn't come to that. Once you build it, the mop will become your constant companion, your tool, and a ready means of defense against spills of all kinds. Uh, build it? <sighs> the wood is the heart of the handle. The heart is the handle of the cook. You are one. Not helpful so far. You must find a particular tree. A tree uniquely suited to the handles of mops. Carve your handle from a limb of that tree. Any questions? A lot. How do I find the mop handle tree? I can't tell you exactly where it is because this is your own personal journey. What kind of wood is the tree? That is something you must discover for yourself. What about the head of the mop? Oh, you have to have one, of course, but pretty much anything will do. It's mostly about the handle. Okay. Are you sure I can't just buy a mop? Yours, for example. No, you've got to make one. He would never sell his mop. Did this. you just listen to the past like 15 minutes of that? Okay, I guess I'll do it. What's wrong? You gave the story the wrong title. It should be called Mop Quest. When do we get to the piratey parts? Well, even the coolest professions involve more mopping up than you would think. I, it seemed crazy to me at the time, too. But don't forget, it was all so I could board a ship, take command, and sail to Monkey Island. But first, I had to make a mop. It's interesting how much they're using, like, the, um, narrative frame to give hints. Active little guys, aren't they? Well, Surreptitiously abscond. A mop. Uh, I do need to talk to the cook more. Pests or garnishes? A good cook sources local supplies when he can. I'm not eating here, I don't mind. The food is more exciting when you can smell the risk. Ugh, I remember that stench as if it were yesterday. Lovely. Looks like a mugshot. We're definitely going outside. 
I think someone tried to secure a boat with this. Grab string. The plot Wooden. says, in memory of looming seagulls of old. I want to pick it up. There's no fish out there, though. That fish was an absolute bitch to get. Uh, the yeah. atmosphere in the bar is different than it used to be. Yeah, I don't like it, but I've got to cater to the new crowd. Everything changes, Guybrush. But the roaches stay the same. I've missed your wit. And your low alcohol tolerance. <laughs> hey! You look giggler. Um. Did I mention I'm going to find the secret of Monkey Island? No, I don't think you did. Well, that's exciting. So you'll be hiring a ship at the docks? I'm going to steal the chucks. Bold! I like your thinking. Ooh, I think I hear the health inspector. What? Where? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> uh, that joke never gets old. <laughs> but also, if you run outside, I can steal Thanks. your mop. Will but do. I know that it's not going to let me. Stay away from my mop. Yeah. Bye, friend. Now I'm going to go to Wally and talk about forest maps. He had a fishing lure on his hat. Okay. Same as the fishing lure I saw at the locksmith. for a tree to make a stupid mop from. Have you got a map for that? So the cook has sent you on one of his spiritual journeys? Been a while yes. since I made one of those mop tree maps. What kind of tree is it again? I don't know. A wood one? That's okay. Just bring me a sliver of the wood and I can work it out hmm. from there. I'm that good. Okay. Bye. Sliver of mop wood. I can figure that out. Let me look at my inventory. None of that will help me. No, yeah, I'm doing this. Just want like a knife or something, you know? I'm gonna find the secret of Monkey Island. Oh, there's Don't a new guy. Much like pirating to me. Like this guy, the clean-looking pirate. Hi. Ooh. Are you my waiter? I want the excellent dish I had at the governor's mansion last week. I I don't know what it's called, but it was sort of, you know, a hot food. Yeah, but I'm not. Start. It had ingredients in it or something. I'm not your waiter. I already told your incompetent cook this, but he still hasn't brought me my dinner. I don't work here. I'm not a waiter. Up to it! Uh, right away, sir. It's a candle. Fancy. Okay, so he wants a hot dinner. So, as I'm talking to Cook again, well, I admire the well, mop. It's definitely a mop. All right, let's talk to the cook. Well, you look like the health inspector tasted your stew, or you did. Worse, Marlin. Marlin is here. Who? The customer I have nightmares about. He's the only importer of yak fat on the island, so I need to keep him happy, but he makes that impossible. Today he wants me to make him a dish that he ate last week at some kind of event at the governor's mansion. But of course he doesn't remember what it's called or Yes, he's going back to the governor's mansion. What color it was. He says he thinks it has I talked to him, I got all yeah, in it. okay. I don't have the slightest idea what to make. If I brought you a recipe, could you make it? Of course. I'm a cook. See the hat? Okay, you said the Gunverse Mansion, so I don't need to ask that question, and I won't. Oh, look behind you! A three-headed monkey! I do know a great stew recipe for monkey heads, but I can't think about that right All now. All right, we'll get you the freaking recipe. I'll see what I can find out. Thanks. And then we'll see... What was that? Oh, steal the picture. Stay away from that picture! Interesting. We'll be back. We're gonna do a lot of stealing once, um... Once you get out of the kitchen, I suppose. Ah, dang it! Every time. Hold up. Every time I accidentally click out. That time I accidentally clicked on start streaming, so that's... 
Everything's still going. I think we're good. <laughs> Governor's Mansion. Carla, talk to me about food. Right, we have to be doing this every time we talk. That's a necessity. She has so much muscle. Well, I've come for a recipe. A dish you served at a recent function. It's been described as hot and having ingredients in it. Ring any bells? I do host plenty of functions, but I'm afraid I don't have any idea what you're talking about. Marlon Marlon really was there? Say. I just like doing this. Practice is nice, but I'm busy these days. Governor stuff. Okay. Oh, the books are all yellow. I didn't realize that. That makes it way easier. It's a cookbook. It has four stars, but it looks like they're for difficulty. Let's see if we can borrow that one. Can I borrow a book? You never brought back the last book. You yeah, know. yeah. I'll pay for it. I don't need. Cause last time I said I'm sorry, but she didn't believe me. So maybe I need to fix this situation with her. It's a lot of work being governor. Um, okay, was there anything that I can do? Just give her money. Just give her money. Can I pay you for the book I lost? I don't need your money. <sighs> All right. Oh, I can it's untangle. Hopeless. Oh. Squeeze it's it. good for relieving stress. Interesting. I don't need a hint. have anything to say You're just like yeah, okay double checking okay so i need to figure out how to borrow a book from carla and i haven't really edgy checked out most of the stuff here but i think i might have already exhausted it yeah i think i exhausted everything in here okay i need to figure out how to borrow a book from carla Double check. Can I borrow a book? You never brought, you never even apologized. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm hearing the words, but sign it. Yeah. All right. Yeah, nothing here makes sense to give to you. Sorry, Carla. What if I cleaned up the frickin' dog? Yellow flowers here, it's a nice touch. Yay, I'm stuck. Oh, that's good. Okay. I was worried I wouldn't be stuck. So he needs a bit of the wood, and I need to get the recipe for the dew. Let me talk to the voodoo lady now that she's back from her luncheon. Let me exhaust that. I haven't actually been able to look around yeah, here. It's empty. Green, half off. Blue, half of half off. Yellow, half of half of half off. Orange, aren't you glad you're here? It's an unusual safe with five keyholes. Mm -hmm. Alas, the safe is not for sale. It has been placed with me for safekeeping. Safekeeping. You do gift wrapping? We're out of wrapping paper, unless you'd like it wrapped in the skin of a lizard. No thanks. Mm -hmm. Keep up the good work, buddy. It's a creepy shrunken head with long stringy hair. I didn't like a mop? Were a voodoo thing. They're not. But the tourists like them. Looks like a mop. I'll take this disgusting shrunken head. That's my last one. Quite the bargain. Nice. This is a neat symbol. 
What does it mean? That used to contain magical disguises. Mm -hmm. But alas, they have all gone. Oh, a knife. It's too bad you're sold out. A magic disguise seems really useful. There's always the famous eye patch of John Naney at the museum. The museum? I'm sure the magic has worn off by now. But I believe I could restore museum. its abilities. You have a museum? Pointy. It is a non-magical ceremonial knife. Very sharp indeed. Oh, I'd like this knife. An excellent choice. I will need you to verbally agree to a release of liability. Okay. This product is not to be used in the commission of any crime, including vandalism, jailbreak, and theft of ancient priceless artifacts. No problem. Threatening, frightening, stabbing, shaving, or manicuring yourself or another person are likewise considered outside the scope of acceptable use. I kind of just oh. want to use it on a mop okay, for now, yeah. so The product yeah. is not balanced for throwing. Throwing the product violates these terms and will invalidate the warranty. Okay. Whittling, scrimshaw, mumbledy peg, juggling, and any tricks involving stacking or balancing the product may cause some serious whittling. injury and should not be attempted by unlicensed persons. Uh -huh. Use with breads, spreads, bedspreads, or thread may damage the product. If damaged, the product should not be used. Product is sharp and should not be carried in a pocket, coat, belt, hat band, handbag, shoulder holster, or and the period at button. all times. Keep the product away from children, pets, the aged or infirm, clowns, pirates, and adults. Where possible, it should be locked securely in a vault. The manufacturer accepts no responsibility for the consequences of any use or misuse of this product. By verbally assenting to these terms, purchaser hereby assumes all liability, past, present, and future, throughout this and all possible and impossible universes. Oh, is this where I say yes? Yes. Yes. Is there anything I am allowed to do with it? I am not able to answer that question, as it could create a liability issue. I'm so glad that I have money. What's this frog? What's this thing? It's a forgiveness frog. When <gasps> no apology will do... It's exactly what I need. Forgiveness frog. It's like a card, only much better because it's a frog. I've never heard of that before. Are you sure it's real voodoo? No comment. It works. I want it. Trust me. I'll take this forgiveness frog. It can help someone forgive, even very old All right, seems like we have a plan to get everything together then, assuming I find out where this museum is. Um, have a little bit of time left here. Shiny. A crystal. Yeah, this isn't that kind of game. Fair enough. Sorry about that. Phone, uh, phone vibrated. Actually, let me double check that I can't find the crystal. Open the safe. I'd need a lot of keys to open that. Okay. I don't, I just have the one and it doesn't work. I'll, I'll worry about the safe later. Let's go back to the mansion, get the book, and then go back to the cook and get the mop. Yeah, I'll play for a couple more minutes. Oh, wait, I meant to give her the frog. I don't really have any practice. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Inventory. The voodoo lady said it was a forgiveness frog. Just wanted to see what he said. This is for you. You're giving me a frog? It's a forgiveness frog for when words aren't enough. You haven't even bothered to write anything personal on this frog. That's just rude. I reject your frog. You'll accept my frog soon enough. Dear Elaine. Carla. Dear Carla. Sorry for blowing you up. I did do that. Forgetting your birthday. Forgetting your anniversary. Losing the book Sorry I borrowed. Sorry for losing the book I borrowed. You're tough on toughness, hard on softness. Dedicated to dedication. 
keen on bluntness. Oh. Someone said they were hard on softness recently. I admire that you are hard on softness. As shown by your actions at. She definitely said one of these before. As shown by your actions at Santo Domingo, please accept my humblest apology. No, it wasn't really my fault. Um, I promise to do better. I've implemented a reminder system for myself. You scare the heck out of me. She actually might you scare the heck out of me. She might appreciate that. If all of those need to be right, then I don't know what to do. This is for you. Reelect Governor Carla. She's hard on softness. Honoring Melee Island's 27th Governor Carla the Swordmaster for her heroic actions at Santo Domingo. Carla, I'm impressed, Guybrush. Surprisingly thoughtful. Considering it's you, I'm strangely moved to forgive you for losing my book, and I'll treasure this frog as a memento of the time you did something right. I try. See, I haven't gotten to the uh, part of the last episode. I started editing the video. But I have not finished Can I borrow this video. cookbook? So I haven't gone through my conversation with the governor again. <laughs> so I'm kinda you lucky. Cook like a cow. That's why I need the cookbook. Oh, all right. I was upset after you lost the last one, but you seem genuinely sorry, so I guess I'll give you another chance. Thanks. I won't let you down. I'll definitely return this. Oh definitely I, I will return it. I will actually return it. Let's see if that's enough for the, uh, the cook. Ooh, double click does the runny run. <laughs> What's wrong with me? Okay. Um, needed to go one more. <sighs> Look at him jaunt to the bar. Yeah, we'll get your what's it food. It's a cookbook. It has four stars, yeah, okay. but it looks like they're for- I found this at the governor's mansion. Aha! Uh -huh. Probably should have asked Marlin Marlin. I have no idea which one it'll be, so I'll just have to make them all. Or that. I'd better get to work. Thanks well, if much. any of them aren't hot, then... This will be excellent. All right, well, he's hard at work. I am going to grab the knife, carve a little bit of wood, and that won't piss him off. <laughs> I carved it off the cook's mop handle. Good times. Good times. Can I steal this now? Great. <laughs> Bye, friend. <laughs> All right, I am going to get the map. Sample of the wood you wanted. Can you make me a map now? That was quick. <laughs> sure, here it is. Thanks, Wally. Cool. It's torn and ugly, but strangely compelling. Yeah, why do I have that? Aha, 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 aha. So go to forest carnivorous plant. Go past the plant, purple, purple, plant, purple, plant. Easy peasy. We're using the plants to get to the place that we need to go. I'm glad that I went to the forest already. Okay, I'm not gonna do that now. Well, that's great. Let me just double check the things that I missed when I was clicking on things. I tried to steer clear of sea monsters myself. Small monsters, small. Somewhat map. understated and somewhat overpriced. Huh, never seen one of those before. And that's probably most of the things. I didn't look at the fan map next time maybe. I'm sure we'll be back at Wally's map store. I think that's gonna do it for me today. That was um, pretty, pretty straightforward so far. Um, folks are saying um, in the comments of the first video so far that um, puzzle solving hasn't really been a major challenge. So we'll see how this gets along. I did just see a little silhouette there. That might be 
whitey bones or something. I don't know. So yeah, I'll see you next time that we decide to play more Return to Monkey Island. So bye. You mean the latest masterpiece of fantasy storytelling from Lucasfilm's Brian Moriarty? Why, it's an extraordinary adventure with an interface of magic.